Hello everyone or welcome to my channel if you're new here. As you can see by today's title of the video, I'm going to be trying creative photography at home. So without further ado, let's get into it. So for the gear or equipment, we have a glass cooking dish with some water in. Then we have olive oil to create some bubbles effects and um, washing up liquid. Then we have another glass of water. Hopefully we can c create some c cool effects with that. And then we have a Samsung Galaxy Tab A6 tablet um, for the background that we're going to be using from the internet coloured gradient background. Roll the B-roll in three, two, one. everything set up or at least some of it let me just put this on here so now the cooking dish is on the tablet and the background is ready um we're going to start shooting by the way all of this is going to be shoot on a um, mobile device but you can shoot it on whatever you have a mobile camera tablet it doesn't matter what you have it's really fun and easy to do so you should try it at home I will also be using my normal camera that comes with the phone and also the built-in camera that allows you to have more access and more advanced features on, on your camera which is the camera on the Lightroom app. So first, this photo is going to be taken with the normal app on my phone and it's just going to go like that. Actually also, before we do that going to add a little bit of uh, washing up liquid not too much though and then we've actually the liquid is actually sat at the bottom of the dish so we're going to actually try and capture that for a minute um, hopefully that will be really cool effects So as you can see on screen now, that was a really cool effect, effect with all the uh, different colours in and the washing liquid at the bottom. So now you can see that we're on the app there, that's the Lightroom app. And as you can see, it has all these really cool features here. Um, just click on Pro, it's on Professional at the moment. You also have the choice for Automatic, so it's on Professional and you have all these choices down here. So, I'm going to take a couple of photos with the Lightroom camera and I'm going to compare the photos between the Lightroom camera and the camera that comes with the phone. I'm going to compare the photos at the end of this video, so make sure you keep watching. So I'm going to place my phone there. I'm going to bring the focus up a bit. So focus on the bubbles. And... So now we're going to take some photos with the Lightroom app. So I'm just going to bring my phone over and bring down the exposure a bit. Lock the focus there. Bring the exposure down. So you'll be able to see them up on screen now. As you can see, some of them actually turned out really good. Others didn't, not that well, but it's all a bit of a practice, really. Um, so it's actually really fun. See, so that was them. And now for the final shot, I want to try out if I can put this glass here of water actually inside there. So hopefully it cr can create a really cool effect. effect. Um, between a uh, cooking dish and a glass. So I'm just going to take a couple of shots now. 
actually for this one I'm actually just going to use gla glass because I've just spotted this really cool effect. So as you can see that on the screen now, I personally thought that was a really good effect because it's like the bubbles at the side of the glass and then it draws your eyes in so it's like a kind of like circular leading line. So earlier in the video I said I was just going to be using the default camera on my phone and also the uh, camera in the Lightroom mobile app. Um, so I just wanted to say uh, if you don't have like manual settings and stuff on your default camera it's definitely worth getting that uh, Lightroom app that comes with the camera because it just allows you to have a bit more control over the settings and all the settings on your camera so you can get the best quality photos out of your camera that you have. So now I'll show you on screen the ones that I really liked. So the first one is this one. Um, I think this was not the number one favourite for me because it had the glass in the uh, cooking dish and it had all the bubbles around the glass with the green right in the middle and the centre. So I really liked that one. And now this one on screen, which I just like because of the colours in it and it had it was in focus, so that's always a good. If you have tried any of these yourself, make sure to tag me on Instagram. And also I, ha I now have a Discord server if you didn't know. The link is in the description, the first link, so make sure you check that out. You can post it on there so everyone can see. And really, I think that's it for today's video. So, I'm out.